Hi, welcome to the Cycro 10 Basic Tutorial Training. Today in this video, I would like to show you how to preview a page in Cycro 10 before you want to publish anything to the website. Okay, so now let's get started. Open browser and then access into the Cycro. Go to the content editor here. So here, assuming this is the home page you are working on. And in the home page, we have the title and the text of the description. Okay, so basically here, I want to change some the title. Cycle Experience Platform Manager. Measurements, yeah. Here. And the below, I will have the text. Click on it, and then I will duplicate the content here. Yeah. Edit. Here we have some the okay. Let me copy this one because this has some the formatting. Right here, oh, no, no, no. Right here and here. Okay, it look better. Accept and then I click on save button. Yeah. And because for now we have not set it into the master database, yeah. I will talk about the master database and web database later on in other video. Yeah. So here, or uh, after you set this one, it's still not published to the website. Yeah. Okay. So here, let me copy this one, and I will open it in the other new tab. Yeah. You see here, or here, because you are set into the cycle admin show. You can see the new change here. However, if I open it in the incognito mode, yeah, you see here, we st we still see the older content. Okay, so close this one, and then for now, I'm not sure how that it look after I publish on the new change into the website. So I want to preview it first. Yeah. In order to preview the content show, you select the home page and then go to the publish tab in the ribbon. Click on the preview button. It will direct you to the Ethereum editor page. Yeah. So here in the ribbon, you can specify some date to see the how your website looks at the point of the past or the future. Yeah, so here I can change the date here. Could click on next button. Yeah. In case if you are going to apply some the condition on the website, for example, you want to just publish this banner in three days. And after three days, this banner will be disappear. Yeah. So for example, today is 20. If you go to the 24, yeah. This banner have to disappear. That means if you preview it on 24, you can see some changes of the banner. Okay. And of course, on the ribbon, we have some other option. You can see the content in the default device. Yeah. Or you can even see it in the green mode or in fit mode. Back to default, or oh, you can even see it in the simulator. Yeah. So here for the device simulator, you can click on the simulator. By default, it is none. Yeah. You can even select the Android phone, Android tablet, Flash, BlackBerry, Future Phone, HD TV, iPad, iPhone, and Windows Phone. Yeah. So here, I will select the iPhone. Yeah. And you see here, after you select the iPhone device show, the content will be displayed in the iPhone. Yeah. And the device simulator here, it is a not pixel perfect rendition of the website, and it appears on each device. However, it gives you a good indication on how device presents the website and it less content author 
quickly see how basic look on mobile device. Yeah. So here you can increase the percentage. Yeah. Okay, right. Yeah. And even protect this one from portrait to landscape. Yeah. Okay. Change it to the iPad. Rotate it. Yeah. It look better. Yeah. Okay. You can scroll up, scroll down, and left or right. Yeah. It looks similar when you access this website via the real devices. Yeah. Okay, change it to the Blackberry. Good. Okay. So I hope this video will have fun for you. After you finish this lesson, you know how to change the content in Psycho CMS. And then before you publish any new changes to the website show, you can do the preview it. Yeah. And in the Preview mode, you can change it to some specific date to see the news update after some the past and the future days for the website. I hope this video will have fun for you. Bye bye. Let's have some time for break and we will come back to continue learning at the lesson.